Hey there guys, how's it going? It's Axel Bit here and we are continuing with Let's Play Batman A Telltale Series Episode 3. In the last part we went back to the Batcave, well we were already in there, and we had a look at the back doors, went to see Harvey, he is going insane, turning into Two-Face, which is always a nice turn of events. However, we're trying to stay on his good side still. We promised we wouldn't tell people he's talking to himself in two different voices. But, um... I'm not sure how long it's going to last before he starts actually going crazy. Because one side of him wants to turn like the city into a military zone. And then uh, we went to Vicky Vale and she told us about a meeting she had with the children of Arkham. And we're doing a bit of an investigation and we're going to finish it up now. So, uh, we'll link this dude. Drug confirmed, no injection. Uh, we want to link that to the nozzle maybe? Where's the nozzle? The nozzle was... Where was the nozzle? Uh, look into this. Hmm. This doesn't add up. Okay. Well, fuck you then. Uh, break link. Let's do the chemistry lab then. Oh, come on. There we go. They've altered the drug so that it can be absorbed through the skin. Right, so that one was right. Next we got train station. It's probably going to link up to uh, the modified train carts. The modified train car is going to be sent to Mercy Street Station. Okay. And so that just leaves us with these two. We've got the chemical barrels stolen from the docks mixed with uh, the absorbing agent. The drug is being modified here. They're changing it. The drug. The children of Arkham must have found a way to weaponize it. We already said that. There's a way to the absorb it through the skin. Absorb into skin. It will affect hundreds of people at once. They're loading the modified drug into the tanks on the train cars, dispersing it through the sprinklers. Yep. The timers are set to go off just as it rolls in over the crowds. We are prepared to contain something of that scale. Releasing a drug like that in so populated an area would be devastating. They could infect the entire city if they had enough. That's probably the idea. There wasn't enough of the chemical to mix with the rest of the stockpile of drugs. So they'll find more. There's a train coming. Oh, it's cool. Knew someone was going to show up. Surely someone can see out that front window, and you just went straight up in front of it. Oh, it's the big bad boss man himself. Or herself, to be honest. Looks a bit thin. If I'd known you were going to make me lug this thing myself, I would have worn more comfortable shoes. Oh, Catwoman. Just add it to the list of your mistakes. Must be why you didn't come through on your last assignment. Hmm. Well, that was a bit of a surprise. It's all here. Well, it wasn't going to be gone. It's not like we're going to lug one around with us. Okay, you two, get these mixed, load it onto the train. This way. Huh? Our leader is here. We have Catwoman. Catwoman. She's got more of that absorbing agent. She must have a good reason for being there. Uh, the main forester, she's working for them. Selena plays both sides. So she that's... plays whatever side meets her needs. Yeah. Currently, her needs seem to be focused on keeping all nine of her lives. I mean, she did say, to be fair. We're done here, right? Not yet. No, 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 no. There's no part two of this. I got what you wanted. I'm done. <laughs> okay. Might as well come out, Batman. I know you're here. No, no way. I did not bring him here. I honored our deal. Oh, I know you did. But now, you're a loose end. Surrender. Unless huh. you'd like to see firsthand what a critical dose looks like. No, thank you. She joined poor Esther Cobblepot. Uh. Death might be preferable. Fuck. I surrender. Take me instead and let her go. Now, screw this. I'm not that sort of damsel. Yeah, that doesn't seem like a good idea when I press the button, I'll be honest. Train's ready! Move up! 
Oh, really? This is what we're doing? Okay. Oh my god, okay. That guy probably doesn't have a face anymore. Uh, oh my god, he can still fight. Fuck. Okay. Ah, oh, I missed that one. Damn, okay. Oh, shit. Fuck, I hate how it just jumps to the center like that. I'm not ready for it. Yeah, sorry, dude. You're next, apparently. Hmm. That didn't make the noise I thought it would. Really? I didn't even do anything, though. Okay. Uh, no, thank you. What? Oh. What is that? What the fuck? Hey, Doctor Strange, I think you got the wrong franchise. You're just here to stoke the flames. You do a lot of talking. Not sure you can back it up. Try me. Well... Show me how you save your precious city. Why are your gloves so fucking shiny? Just like the other live. Oh, I saw that one coming. Oh my god, a suit has a gash already. Not sure. Oh, fuck. Okay. That was. I don't, I don't even know what this this person is. I mean, I'm guessing it's all these shockwave things or all the suit and everything, but it's weird as shit. Well, that is a gash. Too bad Lucius can't fix it for us anymore. Grab the thing. The hell. You had all that time and you did nothing. You could have blasted that thing away. What the fuck is this now? I don't know. What is going on? Those are the sticky bombs, right? So this thing's going down. It's the middle of the night, what are you hoping to do? Busiest station or not, most people aren't using it anymore. Well, we just nearly killed a few people. Oh well. What? Oh! Oh, okay. Bit over dramatic. He could have just collapsed. Fuck me. Or, oh, well, you know, you could fuck me. Don't pass out on me. Do my best. What, you just gonna let us leave now? Should have gone after. Shut up. Good what the the get you somewhere safe. They're literally just gonna let us leave? Just stay with me. What the fuck? Ooh, Selena's apartment. Wait, we got there at like five to nine and now it's twelve? I know. Come on. Like three hours? The fuck? Did you stop for coffee on the way? Damn, okay. Strip me down. Ooh. Stay here, okay? Just don't move. Thank you. Selena. Don't thank me yet. What, are you going to tell them where I am now? Shit. 
You're lucky you were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? Uh, what? <laughs> Showing up at that train depot. Taking on their leader alone. Well... Repeat after me, Bruce. I am not invincible. And painkillers do not solve the problem. I'm not invincible, but painkillers you solve a lot. Take them down on your own. Um, they killed you. Good advice. I'll be sure to keep that in mind. Suddenly so agreeable. Yeah. I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Yeah, oh, great. And blood that's just you appearing from nowhere. You some morning. I feel like I owe you anyway. That's twice now. You just keep adding things to my list, don't you? Selena. I told you I don't like owing people. Well, lists are only good Probably if there's more than one thing on them. Anyway. I don't want the children of Arkham finding this place. I had it handled, you know. With their leader. I had a plan. Uh, really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. Didn't know you'd be there. I was there tracking the children of Arkham. I had no idea you'd be there. Must have been quite the surprise. Yeah. Just a bit. Yeah, it was. That was gonna be my ticket out of here. Ooh. One last job to get the goons off my back. So much for that. Thanks again, Bats. I'm sorry I messed things up for you back there. I know. I'm used to it anyway. There's no such thing as a fresh start. No. Oh, cat. Well, look who's back. Who didn't see that one coming? Hey, little one. Really likes your thigh. Ooh. I don't think she likes you. No, she doesn't. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. Hey, I promise I don't bite. Yeah, but she does. Oh, good. Cut That's what I out. need. Cat tearing me up after this. The fuck is that? Oh, it's probably some kind of ointment. This really hasn't been your week, has it? No. <laughs> you think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was just like everyone else. No, a bit worse They've than everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something, just beneath the surface. I'm starting to see that for myself. Even you have your secrets. Yeah, but, I mean, my secret's Batman. Those things you hide from the world. Um, let anyone else see. Yeah, honest. I don't have any secrets from you. You know, I have heard that a thousand times. But you might be the first to actually mean it. You're a good man, Bruce. Oh, thank but you. good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Well... Knowing there's no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. Oh, uh, you're more than Who that. That's probably going to piss her off. That's not all you are. I think that's just what you want people to believe. You put a lot of faith in someone who doesn't deserve it. I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but... I've taken plenty from good people, too. For what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town. The high is nice, but it wears off. I'd like an apartment like that, Christ. I mean, maybe tidy it up a bit, but... See. Nothing. So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. Uh, but it never amounts to anything, really. I like it here. I think the place has... Charm. <laughs> What's charming about it? The leak in the ceiling or the dirty underwear on the floor? It's not what I meant. Hmm. Uh, I don't know what happens this in this class. situation. Help me. Mean to say that out loud? Someone write a book on this. What am I supposed to do? Oh good, she made the first move, thank god. I don't know if that was the right choice or not, but fuck it. Ah, fuck that shoulder, man. I'll make it up to you. Mm. 
Do I have to do all the work myself? Or are you gonna undo this for me? Uh, I want to watch you. Fuck it. I think I'd rather watch you. Damn. Wasn't quite expecting this to happen in episode three. <laughs> yep. I love it when I just touch face with someone. The fuck happened there? <laughs> Uh, what? Oh, I thought that was the front door for a second. I was like, damn. At least, like, hold back for a little bit, maybe? Don't need to show the world just yet. Right, I'll have to write that down, put clothes back on after done. Rise and shine. Not yet. Well, I guess that means I'm making breakfast. Wow. Okay. You even know how to work a toaster, Rich King? What the fuck is a toaster? Oh, too bad. I think there might be bagels in the fridge. We definitely check expiration dates on anything. Before you think about putting it in your mouth. Should have checked the expiration date on my dick. <laughs> Pretty sure I was a self burn actually, but the hell with it. Oh good, my helmet has a self destruct sequence. Good thing that kicked in this morning. Bruce. Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. No, you should have been. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened. If, if you were. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to worry you, Alfred. Oh, sure, well, got I, fucked up. I'm just glad you're okay. Kind of. I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, well. Where are you, anyway? I, uh... I stayed at Selena's last night. Oh. Well, that certainly explains it. <laughs> you got something to say, Alfred? I'm not judging you. <laughs> it sounded like you were. I wouldn't dream of it. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around. If she's trustworthy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, um, that's a smart idea. I think she's kind find. of trustworthy. At the very least, you can find kind that of. grapple gun of yours. Right. Ah, uh, she might need that. You'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Uh, oh, there's Chinese on the table. Home, Bruce. I think I'll let her keep it since we have a spare. And there was, an there was another one in R&D. We don't quite have access to it, but... This was an exhibit at the Gotham Museum. Maybe Lucius could Mars. get it to us. I helped raise the funds for it. Lucius even set up new security for the museum. How did she get in? Okay. Stolen paintings, cool. She didn't even frame that last one. Look at takeout containers, sure. She can afford to eat anywhere, and she still chooses Chinese takeout. That isn't even the good place. Well, she might be saving. We don't know. These strong magnets on these things. Very lightweight, though. They could use something like this. Yeah, let's not steal her stuff. Her cat eats like a queen while she's eating junk. Look at bookshelf. Scarlet Pimpernel, much ado about nothing. Petraka. <laughs> Didn't take her for a romantic. What's this one? Oh, the Gita Govinda. That's academic. Is that supposed to be smutty like Fifty Shades of Grey or is it like a sex position book? I'm gonna guess it's one of those two. Ah, I think she's been taking this apart. Look how it works. There you are. Uh, I hope she didn't break anything. I think we'll leave you. She might need it. It might come up in a future point where she needs to get away quickly and it's just not there. And we will call it apart there, folks. So, thank you very much for watching. And I will see you in the next part. Thanks for watching, guys.